Turning up to a broken EV charger sucks. So today, I'm helping my buddy EV Nick launch a new solution to the UK. And they're launching with their first network, Ionity. So get the And Charge app, take part in challenges, post pics of the chargers, and then you get rewarded for it. Now, for years, I've been leaving comments in third party apps, hoping, praying that somebody somewhere sees that feedback. Well, charge operators across Europe have been partnering with And Charge. Now they're coming here. You can leave feedback on the app and that gets sent to the charge operators and you get rewarded for it. Stay tuned today. I've been on the road for Nick as a roving reporter. Have a look at the video next and let me know what you think in the comments below. Today I have something really important to tell you about and before you go oh no not another app this thing has four really important features to tell you about including exchanging real life points you earn on the app for charging credits and even shopping vouchers. Thanks to Anne Charge for sponsoring this video, we actually have Martin live charger now. Martin, what are the four unique points about the Anne Charge app? Yeah, that's right, Nick. Hello, hello everybody uh, watching. Here we are just off the M25 at an Ionity station at Cobham, actually. And as you've already mentioned, Nick, there's some really great features of the Anne Charge app. You've mentioned the point system already. I'll also mention the two-way reporting as well that you can report problems or anything wrong that you see with a charging station or a charging network and you can even get some feedback on that as well and also there's a gameplay aspect as well it'll set challenges for you you can collect rewards like badges if you like almost be a local charging hero now i have got the and charge app because it gives you a, a better experience but if you've simply charged and want to give some feedback on a station or network you can do that they'll be rolling out the charging experience you've had and that gets sent back to the charge operator so when you say the charge point operator you mean unlike some other apps where i've looked five days ago a user said the charger wasn't working and basically no one from that charge point company has ever seen it because they're not part of you know looking at these apps you're saying that and charge actually work direct with some charge point operators like actually tell them that the charge is not working yeah that's right i think that's one of the important things that we can all do as a bunch of ev drivers if we assemble as a community we can help each other out and give feedback when we have good and bad experiences okay assemble mine now it says on here that you've got some and charge challenges to complete and for completing those challenges you'll learn kilometers which is their point system now i've asked them to have a toggle switch to maybe change kilometers to miles so it makes a little bit more sense for us here in the uk but what are these challenges what are they asked you to do martin Absolutely. So depending on what charging station you're at or what's near you or where you turn up to, each challenge may be slightly different. Now here, they've just added Unity as a partner to the And Charge app. So they're looking for some more information and to get an understanding of what the chargers are like. So when I turned up here today, they wanted a picture of the charging station, what the parking spaces were like, pictures of the connectors to make sure they're in good condition, even the retraction system and also the general cleanliness and what the area was like around it. Now, because of that, because they're asking you to do quite a lot while you're waiting for your EV to charge, because you've got to do something while your car is charging, it's a great little challenge to be given. They reward you higher for things like this. So I've earned myself 10 kilometers inside the And Charge app today for doing that very simple set of pictures and uploading them whilst I was waiting for my car to finish charging. Okay, and I assume they will see these challenges and these photos that you've completed at the CPO, and they will use this to assess damage and what parts and what bits that need to see and if they need to send out another engineer or more challenges to assess more, more things that are wrong with the charge or may, may need repairing. But what's to stop all these photos going into a black hole at the CPO and never being read and never being actioned? Yeah, now that's actually a really good point. And I'm sure you, like me, many people watching this, if you've got a few apps on your phone over the years, charging on your electric vehicles many of them have asked you to upload pictures they've been around a long time though and some of those pictures are out of date some of those charges haven't worked in a long time some of those charges aren't even there anymore so the great thing about the and charge app is they partner with networks that want to know about their charging stations now whilst many of them are connected and they're online they still want that real person feedback so the difference is here is that in this case ionity they want to know your charging experience and it's going to be listened to and there's even the potential for two-way feedback as well i can 
Imagine a time in the future where you log a report inside the app and very quickly they could respond and say, an engineer is on the way tomorrow or a part is on back order for two weeks. Now that cliche, no news is good news. I don't agree with that in terms of EV charger feedback. I want to know some news, even if it's not the best news, which is we can't fix it for a little while. You want to know you're being listened to. Now for now, they can do things like send newsletters and update people on the feedback that you've given. Okay, you've given me some confidence that my data is not being wasted, but you said there's some fun in this app. Where's the fun? Martin? Martin, hello, are you there? Uh, now, Nick, look, I'd love to stand here all day and chat with you, but there's more challenges to do inside the And Charge app, and I love a good challenge, so I'm gonna go and do those, and as I've always wanted to say, back to the studio. Thanks, Martin. Now, while Martin goes and finishes off those tasks, let's talk about how you can earn extra And Charge credits and get them redeemed for various little vouchers. Now, if you shop via the And Charge app using their affiliate link service on their app, you can earn extra bonus points from a whole host of UK stores. These extra kilometer points get added into your and charge account. So on top of any extra sort of points you earn by doing these challenges at charge points, you can earn additional points through these affiliate links. And all these points can then be redeemed in the and charge account for Amazon vouchers or my Hyundai charge credits. Now and charge are always looking for new partners on there and redeem partners. So always check the app out that's always being updated. Now we did mention there was four really unique things about this charge, a charge app that you want to download. And the next one is if you get the app downloaded today, while me and Martin are running this promotion of videos, there's some extra chance of some bonus credits to be earned. The three most active users every single month till the end of the year will win five pound worth of kilometers to spend exactly as they wish. And one lucky user who signs up before the 1st of January, 2023 will win 10 pound worth of kilometers to spend exactly as they wish. So if you don't go down now to the description and download the Uncharge app and sign up, you're losing out on the possibility of winning not only five pound each month, but just 10 pound just for signing up, even if you haven't got any chargers near you that you can do challenges on. Martin, are you, are you still there? Yeah, no, I am still here, just getting ready to go and do some more challenges and earn myself some more kilometers in the And Charge app. But I remembered, I, I can't leave you before I give my regular sign off. There's no such thing. As a self-charging hybrid, I've always wanted to say that. Goodbye. Ah, you beat me to it.